All right. Hey, y'all. So as you can see, I had already started on my hair doing my twist. Um, I also leave the link to my last video that talked about how I achieved my twist and what products I used. Um, but I did just want to show you a quick video and my twists are not as small as the other video because I knew I would be taking them down. So I just wanted to input this clip to show you how I achieve them. All right, y'all. So this has been maybe about five or six days later because I was so lazy during the week that I decided to wear my twist all week and then I decided to take them down on Saturday. So what I'm gonna do is take some of that coconut oil that I mentioned before and I'm just gonna put it all over my head just so that my twist don't look dry and dull. After applying some of that oil to my hands, I'm just gonna start unraveling my twist. Now I noticed that you really can't see what I'm doing in the back. So once I get to the front of my head, I'll kind of slow it down and show you what I actually do to make my twist look good. All right, y'all, so we're at the front, and I kind of just wanted to come back to tell you what I do to my twist. So I'm just gonna take the twist like so. Ooh, I'm ashy, y'all, look at there. And I'm gonna pull it apart. Once I separate the two pieces, I'm gonna take one of those pieces and pull it apart as well. And then I'm gonna do the same thing to the other one. go through and feel and see if I have any look at there one twist left back there so I'm gonna go ahead and take that one to loose lord I'm ashy look at my arms y'all but that's only because I had on a long sleeve shirt I just took it off so I'm gonna separate it like so and do the same thing I did in the front The next thing you want to do is grab your peak and all I'm going to do is fluff my roots. Don't, well I don't comb through my hair, I just fluff my roots. It kind of makes my hair look larger in a sense I guess and I'm literally going to fluff for the longest just to get it to the size that I want it to be once I'm finished.
Hicks. I'm just going to take some of that Eco Salad Gel. My favorite one is the olive oil. And then I'm just going to put some on my fingertips and apply them to my edges. Literally, what I do in every video. And then I'm going to go ahead and grab a toothbrush. And I'm just going to brush them back. Even though you can't see them, I'm just going to brush them back. Then I'm gonna go ahead and do the same exact thing to the other side. Add some Eco Styling Gel. Then I'm gonna take the toothbrush and just literally brush it back. Brush it back. I'm gonna go back in with that peak because I don't like the volume of my hair I want it to be bigger but I'm just gonna continue to pick it until I get it how I like it to look so next um, after playing around with my hair I decided that I'm gonna put some pins in the front just so it won't be in the front of my face I'm literally just going to take my top part of my hair, push it back, put a pin in. And then I'm going to do the same thing to the other side. Take a piece of hair, push it back, and then I'm going to apply a pin. That's just what I like to do. Once you've done that or whatever you decide to do, that's pretty much it. Um, now what I'm going to do is take some of that coconut oil and I am going to place it on my scalp because I saw I had a little dandruff and I didn't want it to look dry. But overall, that's it you all and I hope you enjoyed this video. See you later.